it going, Guardians? Mythical Weapon here, and welcome back to the weekly reset series that I do here on the channel most weeks. Not done in the past couple of weeks because I don't know, I've just not, uh, I've just not uploaded content in a while. So, uh, yeah, I'm back. <laughs> so, um, yeah, hopefully I'm gonna be doing this series plus, um, the series on Saturdays where I basically tell you guys. Trails loot, Zer loot, and that week's twab, because why not? More videos, more information, more views. Just kidding, I do not do this for these guys, uh, I just do it for, you know, your guys' entertainment. Anyway, so, we should probably talk about the Crucible first, which, there's, uh, quite a bit to talk about the Crucible. First off, Iron Banner's back. I love Iron Banner. Who does not love Iron Banner? Uh... I am excited for this week's Iron Banner. Not played it yet though. I've literally just opened Destiny and it is, well, it's 8 o'clock and I downloaded the update at 5. And <laughs> yeah, so th that's not good. No, it takes about 3 hours for me to download Destiny update, a weekly one as well. So yeah. Anyway, Iron Banner's back. Love Iron Banner. Loved it since I joined in Season of the Worthy, not missed the week since, probably missed like one week and not realised it because I am not good with time. Um, and anyway, we're on the topic of the Crucible, I should probably mention that this week's featured Crucible game mode is Mayhem. I like Mayhem, it's a good way to farm your Crucible weapons because you can just sit in the back of the map and spam your tether until you throw the game, because that's the quickest way to win or lose. So if you're looking for that Frozen Orbit Sniper Rival, suggest you just sit in the back of the map and just spam your tether until the game ends. Because you either win or you lose. I mean, I've way get loot. Uh, anyway, we should probably talk about this week, uh, this week's seasonal stuff. So uh, if you haven't already played Seasonal Quest, don't uh, give me any spoilers because I've not played it yet. Um, but I do know that this week's seasonal, uh, well the first seasonal, I guess, strikes, I don't know if there's any se any other seasonal strikes been out, um, so yeah, it's out, the Proving Ground strike is out, not played it yet, don't know what happens in it, maybe we kill Keitel, maybe not, not too sure, also the weekly challenges are out this week, uh, there are currently six of them. Uh, I don't know why they've gone from 10 to 6, but yeah, they have uh, 6 pretty easy ones, but as soon as I logged into the game, I already completed one. No idea what I did though. So <laughs> yeah, that happened. Um, yeah, so they're pretty easy. Also, you know I'm strike is here in the Vanguard playlist for the Nightfall the Ordeal. And to be honest, I'm not that big of a fan of the Arms Dealer. You can play it. Uh, I'm gonna play it uh, this week because I want to get the Shadow Prize. So I want to try and get God Roll because it is an auto rifle. I enjoy auto rifles. It's like one of my most favorite uh, like weapon types, other than uh, what do you call it? <laughs> Pulse rifles, that one, and hand cannons. I love both of those, but auto rifle, you're like at top, and yeah. So I probably think we should talk about the Eververse this week. I'm not doing any Eververse talking uh, in any of my videos, so I think maybe we should talk about the Eververse. So, if we go over to the weekly featured, we have the Neon Helix Shell, which I probably wouldn't recommend. I don't really like it too much, but I'll probably just buy it for my collection. With the flag on emote, once again, don't like it too much, but probably buy it for my collections. We also have the RS... The RJSV 9940 vehicle this week, which apparently it's made by Lord Shax. Um, I don't like it, it's weird looking. We have the Ancient Republic shader from Warmind. Mm, it looks. So it looks. Um, no, not that big of a fan of it. It is quite black and white. Just so I don't like the red on it. It's a bit weird. I mean, let's move over to the main breakfast store. We have this, um, this week's exotic emote, which is a new one. The Rising Dawn. 
which okay this is actually pretty cool i might buy this one if i get enough i mean it is 3250 bright dust we also have the blinding imagery which yeah it's basically what happened when the almighty crashed into you know the mountain spawn tower I'm not a big of a fan of it probably just buy it for my collections as well as the uh the celestial horn shell with its uh it's part of the Celestial Horn vehicle. Mm, they're fine. Probably will never use them though. Uh, but another ship that I actually used to use quite a lot is also here in the other store. The exotic Oradia ship. Don't know if that's pronounced correctly. Um, if you do ask pronounce this word, let me know in the comments below because I have no idea what's up. Uh, and we also have the Shramaya Shring... Shrandeas song. The uh, 1K Voices Exotic Fusion Rifle Ornament this week. Once again, no idea how to pronounce this word. Let me know in the comments. I'll probably just look it up on Google Translate. Let's have the Stasis Projection, uh, Ghost Projection. For this week's free transmat effects, we have the uh, Daito Capsule Entrance. We have the uh, the Past Untethered, or on Earth? On Earth? Yeah, on Earth. Why did I say Untethered? And we have the Vex Invasion Effects. And for this week's weekly Featured shaders, we have the Neopop Wave, Amethyst Veil, Deep Sea Geront, and the Calico's Finest. So, um, that's everything to let you guys know of this week. If you want to know what the hotfixes are, I'll put them in the description below. Also, while you're there, hit that like button and the subscribe button. Also, ring the notification bell so you never miss an upload. And while you're in the description, why not check out the link to my Twitch, my Discord, my Twitter, and my TikTok, because if you enjoy my content here, you'll probably enjoy it on those. Anyway, this is all for me, Guardians. Stay safe, and yeah, it's Mr. Gwevin, signing out. See ya!